Well, if you love the Fort Wayne Children's Zoo, like so many folks in our community, and you love live local music, you can head out tomorrow for a brand new event. Yeah, this sounds so cool. Yes, it does. Our Jessica Walter joins us live from the zoo with the preview. Jessica, good morning. Hey, good morning, Kayla and Julian. Lots of good stuff happening at the zoo this year, including the new rock and roar. This is something I've been practicing saying because it's a little bit of a tongue twister for me. Tell me about rock and roar. I mean, this is something new this year. What kind of inspired this whole thing? Yeah, so, you know, rock and roar is a chance for, you know, parents, adults to come out to the zoo and have just a fun, kid-free evening. Uh, it's, it's relaxing. It's a great time. There's live music. We've got... Um, these custom branded cans from Hop River. It's just a fun time. Yeah, and one thing I want to address tomorrow is this this month's uh, Rock and Roar. It's going to be a hot day, but you guys are kind of prepared. You're going to have water and everything, right? Oh yeah. So I mean, we're expecting some heat, um, you know. But we've all you know living in Fort Wayne, Indiana. <laughs> we're kind of used to the summers here, so we're going to have water stations. We've got plenty of nice shade here at the zoo. It's still going to be a, a fun evening. Yeah, for sure. If you're not scared of the heat, don't worry. It's going to be in the evening, so it'll be mostly shaded, obviously. The zoo is prepared for those hot days, so you can come out tomorrow night from 6 to 9. This is something really cool. They're able to partner with a local brewery and have people out here after hours. Wow, that just sounds like a blast. It does. All right, Jessica, thank you so much. We'll